Hey guys, Doug Bernier from ProBaseballInsider.com. Today we're at third base. I'm going to talk to you a little bit about positioning. We know that if a guy can bunt, we're going to play in a little closer. We know if a guy doesn't run real well, but you know he hits the ball pretty hard, we're going to back up to give us some room for some more range. There's a little area, it's about a five to seven foot, I call it no fly zone, from the baseline between third and second, back about five to seven feet. If we're in this area, we're too far back to field the bunt, but we're too close to give us good range. Also in this area, we tend to be, we tend to get hops that are right near the cut of the grass and the dirt, and sometimes those are unpredictable. So, me, I like to at least be on the grass if I'm expecting a bunt, maybe in a couple steps on the grass. If I'm not worried about the bunt, two strikes, whatever, I like to be back a little bit. I don't have to be too deep, but I want to be behind the five to seven foot area, so if a ball takes a weird hop off that cut, I can still react and make a play. And also, it gives me a little bit more range to make it on, on a hard hit ball. I, I might have, instead of one step in a dive, I might have a step and a half in a dive, or two steps in a dive. So it gives me just a little bit more range to hopefully get that guy on a ground ball.